Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In this video you will see in which direction the price of IOTA has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators RSI, divergence, stochastic RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the hourly time frame for IOTA, the price went up with around 19.1%, but then came quickly down again in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 2.08. Looking at the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 37, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Jumping to the hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are currently very low which means that the price is oversold and a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation is to be expected. You should wait to see if the trend will in fact go up because the K line has yet to cross the D line. Jumping to the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the downside. Jumping to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 44, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Looking at the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line which shows that the current trend is on the downside. We can expect for the price to continue going down or perhaps remain at least stable because the MACD histogram shows the momentum currently being strong. Jumping to the daily relative strength index, the current daily RSI is at 56, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. On the lookout for divergences in the daily time frame, owing to the bearish divergence, the price has already gone down. Moving to the daily stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Moving to the daily MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.